Are you watching news with me, Meher Sheikh? Let's begin with the top headlines. A day after the Supreme Court ordered the centre to provide the Muslim party a five-acre alternate land in the Ayodhya title dispute case, the Sunni work board today said that a decision on whether to accept the land in Ayodhya will likely be taken at its meeting on November 26th. The Apex Court on Saturday backed the construction of Ram Temple at the disputed site in Ayodhya. Amid the Maharashtra political impasse, Shiv Sena is firm on the CM's post while addressing party MLAs at the Mumbai Hotel on Sunday. Shiv Sena Chief Udav Thakwe said, Shiv Sena will no more be carriers of the palanquin. This time a Shiv Sanic will sit in it. On the other hand, BJP holds meet as CM's residence to decide on governor's invitation to form government later today. Senior Congress leader Milan Dovra asked the governor to invite NCP Congress Alliance to form the government in Maharashtra today. Launching a fresh salvo at the BJP's uh, Devendra Fadnavis Shiv Sena MP Sanjay Raut on Sunday said that the former Maharashtra Chief Minister is indulging in politics of fear and also likened him to German dictator Adolf Hitler. He said, when uh, ways of threatening and seeking political support don't work, it is time to accept that Hitler is dead and the looming clouds of slavery have disappeared. As the BJP hopes to form government in Maharashtra for a second term with Devin Dufandamis in charge, Nationalist Congress Party leader Nawab Malik has said his party will vote against the BJP on the floor of the House. Malik said that if Shiv Sena votes against BJP in the House, we will consider supporting an alternate government led by Shiv Sena. As Cyclone Bulbul passes Bengal, Bengal Chief Minister Mamata Banerjee cancelled her North Bengal visit to survey storm affected areas. Cyclonic storm Bulbul, which weakened from very severe to severe, crossed the coast of West Bengal with a maximum wind speed of 110 to 120 km per hour, gusting up to 120 km per hour into Bangladesh. According to IMD, storm is likely to bring isolated heavy spells of rain in, in South Bengal. Mamta Banerjee also said she is monitoring the situation and the administration has taken all measures to tackle any contingency in view of cyclone Pulpur. In view of the landmark verdict in the Ram Janabhumi Barbary Masjid land dispute case, internet services were suspended in Jaipur and Bharatpur on Saturday and now, according to Jaipur Commissioner Rate, suspension of internet services has been extended till tomorrow in the state. On Saturday, the Supreme Court of India backed the construction of a Ram temple by a trust at the disputed site in Ayodhya and ruled that an alternate five-acre plot must be found for a mosque in Ayodhya. As Delhi's struggle for clean air continues, the national capital recorded a decline in the pollution level on Saturday as the Delhi air quality moved from very poor to poor category owing to windy conditions in the city and its adjacent areas. The air quality index on Sunday too remained very poor to poor in most places in the capital and also a hazardous category in a few areas. That's all for now. Stay tuned for more updates. Thank you.